One thing BootMed can do to help you find your files is to search for your My Documents folders, in which most likely will contain the majority of the data you want to retrieve. First, though, BootMed will ask you if you'd like to open up a fat flash drive um, to copy the files to. I'll click yes. My flash drive has already been plugged in. If not, before you click OK, be sure to plug yours in. OK, it found my flash drive. I'm going to select it and click OK. This will open up my flash drive with the, and show me the contents of it. So now I have a window that I can drag and drop files to. And it will also let me know that after I click OK, BootMed Plus will begin scanning for my documents folders. Scanning for my documents folders will do a scan of the entire hard drive for folders called my document. This can take a while. So I clicked OK. Within a minute or two, it should come up with a result. OK, the results are in. It's found two My Documents folders. This is normal. Windows creates a My Documents folder for each of its users, even the guest or default user. So I'm going to click OK, and it will now open the two My Documents folders. Let me rearrange the desktop a little bit so you can see. This My Documents folder is found under the folder Users and then Default. If you look here, you can see the name of the user. Inside the Users folder is a folder for each user with their name. And inside that folder is their Documents folder. So we can tell by looking at this that this is the folder for the default user, which isn't the user I'm looking for. In this window, we see that the user's name is Jake. This is the folder I'm looking for. This folder contains my pictures. So I will now open up the My Pictures folder. And in here, you can see the pictures that I'm looking for. Now I'm going to drag those over here and drop them to my pen drive. They've now been copied to my pen drive. One quick note, Windows 7 and possibly Vista organize the folders in my documents differently than XP did. In XP, it had actual folders for my pictures, my music, and my videos inside the My Documents folder. In Windows 7, it simply created links inside the My Documents folder to the folders which hold my music, my pictures, and my videos. Because of that, you are not able to copy over this link file to your pen drive. It will tell you that it's failed to copy because it's a link. So, cancel. If you're unable to find your videos or pictures or music folders, the best thing to do is click on your username. And in here, you will find all of the folders associated with your Windows account your contacts folder, documents folder, desktop folder, downloads, favorites, links, even your pictures and your music. Everything is in here. So all you need to do now is search for your documents, select them, and begin copying them to your pen drive. 